Hello there, this is Sean Grizzly. Welcome to another edition of our SQL tutorials. Within this tutorial, I will be briefly discussing the NVL statement. Okay, what can the NVL statement do for us? Well, uh, the NVL statement helps us where null values are concerned. Um, you may notice when querying, querying databases, wherever null values are concerned, this is where you're most likely to get a bit of a problem. As data is not present, it's null value, cells are empty. So what the NVL statement does for us is replace every new, uh, null value with a figure um, that you enter into the function. For example, if we want to display the commission, say the commission, uh, of the table using a simple function, which is select com from emp, semicolon. Uh, but using the NVL statement, we can display the commission, but replace all the null, null values. So, what you do here, you type in the NVL function, open bracket. This function takes two parameters, the first of which is the table header, the second of which is what you want to replace all null values by. It would make total sense to replace it by naught. Uh, let's execute this. As you can see, it's displaying the commission, replacing all the null values by a zero. You can then rename this as as commission. Commission, and there's all your commission, replacing all the null values by a zero. You can change them to sevens if you'd like. It's, it is totally up to you, but obviously naught makes much more sense, as I guess null is intended to be zero, but whoever created the tables, the values didn't uh, specify a value. So that is how to use the NVL statement within the SQL environment. I've been Sean Grizzly, thank you for listening, and good night.